Okay, good morning everybody and welcome to your English class, okay? Today class is very, very easy, yeah? So let's start with the class. One, two, and three. Look, to start the class, to start the class, I have a question for you, okay? This question is very, very usual. This question is for everybody, yeah? for everybody. What's your favorite school subject? Okay, this is the question for everybody. What's your favorite school subject? Okay, for example, Williams, what's your favorite school subject? What's your favorite school subject? For example, in my case, teacher Angelo, my favorite school subject is history, for example, history. Let me see Williams. Okay, Williams has some problems with a microphone, come on. Okay, Williams have some problems with a microphone. Let's choose another volunteer, let's see. Bruno, please tell me, what's your okay. favorite school subject? And then Nicole Molina. What my your favorite favorite school subject is history and literature. Literature, that's perfect, very good. And Nicole Molina, what's your favorite school subject? Okay, you can activate your microphone. And then Luis Angela, what's your favorite school subject? For example, Bruno's favorite school subject is history and literature. My favorite school, school subject is mathematics. Math, okay, that's perfect. And let me see, Valeria, please. Valeria Benitez, tell me, what's your favorite school subject? In my favorite school subject is our, um, Computer. And computer, that's perfect, very good. And now, boys and girls, here I have another question, huh? Look, and what do you do there? For example, my favorite school subject is history. And what do I do there? For example, I learn about wars, about cultures, about religions, okay? For example, Valerie, what do you do in art? In art. Let me see. Art is your favorite school subject, but what do you do there? What do you do? Valerie? Okay, Valerie is not there. Okay. Let me see. Uh, Luis Angel, please. What do you do there? What do you do in your favorite school subject? Uh, we... <laughs> okay, try, try. Try to explain with your own words, con tu propia palabra. In math, for example, what do you do in math? We are doing exercise, so... Exercises, that's perfect. Uh, yeah, no more, no more. No more, okay, that's perfect. No <laughs> and, and Bruno, what do you do in your favorite school subject? Sí, le dije que era historia y literatura. Yes, history and literature, but what do you do? Hacer, what do you do there? Ah, exposition. Okay, you expose, exposition. you explain. But you explain about history uh, or about famous books? Uh, history. Exposition okay. in history and uh, in PPT. In PPT, that's perfect. And for example, let's see. Your favorite subject, a school subject, is English. Okay, imagine uh, English. What do you do in English? For everybody, the question is for everybody. What do you do in English? ¿Qué nos gusta de inglés? What do you do, haces, in English? Uh, 
sentado en mi computadora viéndolo a ustedes. Come on, no, oh, yes, yes, you are sitting in your computer watching me, watching the class, but what do you do? You es? We are speaking. We, we are, are speaking. You are speaking, you are learning grammar, you are learning, I don't know, another culture. Yes? So, boys and girls, girls and boys, today we are going to talk about favorite school subjects. Okay, favorite school subjects math, history, geography, arts, math, tics, languages. Okay? And of course, what do you do there? A short explanation about what do you do in these school subjects. Okay? So, very, very quickly, you are going to help me. You are going to help me in some exercises. For example, Nicole Molina told me literature. Williams told me art. Naomi told me English. Thank you, Naomi. Extra point. <laughs> Sorry. And Valerie told me we practice the pronunciation. That's perfect. So, please, boys and girls, girls and boys, this is your book. Okay. This is your book, page 29. Remember, if you have your book, excellent. If you have the paper, excellent. If you don't have, don't worry, okay? You need to participate, okay? So, we are on page 29. And in activity number one, in activity number one, we have the school subjects, okay? We have the school subjects here in the box and here we have eight descriptions okay so you are going to read the descriptions and tell me what a school subject is correct for example one description one description could be podría ser you jump you run you drink water you do exercises what a school subject is geography English or physical education? Physical education. Physical education, okay? So, you are going to read the descriptions and tell me what a school subject is correct, okay? So, let's go to activity number three, okay? So, you are going to help me, please. You are my helpers. Ustedes me ayudan. Let me see. Volunteer to read number one, please. Volunteer ay, to read. Ay, 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 Thank ay, you. Ay. How to use computers. How to use computers. computers studies. Computer studies. That's perfect. Very good. In computer studies, you learn how to use a computer. Very good. Volunteer to help me, number two. Volunteer. Volunteer to help me to speak. Valerie. Me. Valeria. Okay, thank you. Thank you, please. Number two. How to get fit. To keep fit. Fit is similar to fitness, huh? fitness in shape. So, what a school subject is? Fitness, fit, in shape. What a school subject is that correct? Come on, you know Physi the answer. Tell me. Physical education. Physical, Physical education. education. Very good, very good. Volunteer to help me in number three. Volunteer. Volunteer. Come on, me, boys. Peter. Come on, girls. Yo, yo. Me. me. Okay, number three, please. Go to draw and paint. Okay, thank you, Rosa. And draw and paint. What a school subject. Art. Art, that's perfect. Volunteer number four, volunteer. Uh, yo, me. Yo, profe. Okay, thank you, lady. Thank you. And then Valerie, okay? Lady, please, number four. About the language we use it in the UK, English. Okay. English, that's perfect, okay? Another language, language in UK or America, English, perfect. Valerie, please, number five. About important events in the past, history. 
History, that's perfect, very good. Now, volunteer to help me in number six. Volunteer to help me in number six. Nobody, really? Lucero, Williams, Mark, yep. Hi. Okay, yep, thank perfect. you. Okay, thank you, lady. Number six, please. Who the word works? Geography. Geography, that's per. Mm. Okay, repeat, please, number six, lady. Repeat number six. How the word works? Geography. Geography, okay, let's try geography, okay. Now, let's see. Luis uh, Angel, please. Number seven, Luis Angel. How your body works. Biology. How your body works. Okay, we have fix it and we have biology. Biology. Biology, that's perfect. And volunteer to help me, number eight. Yeah. Teacher. Okay, Naomi, thank you. About other countries is geography. Geography, that's perfect. Geography, it's about another country, about the earth. Perfect. And in number six, how the world works. Let's see, let's try physics, okay? Let's check your answers, let's check your answers. Excellent, all your answers are perfect, okay? So, in activity number three, we have remembered that the school subject in a very, very short description about them, okay? Very good, that's perfect. Everything is perfect. Now, boys and girls, girls and boys, let's do um, one exercise a little, a little more difficult, okay? Just a little, listen. In activity number four, we have four school subjects, okay? We have math, we have French, we have uh, religious education, and we have social studies. Social studies is history, uh, geography, or English, okay? Geography, history, and English are social studies. So here, in activity number four, we have four school subjects, and you are going to tell me the descriptions, okay? Descriptions for these school subjects. Las descripciones. For example, I'm going to invent, invento, ah? Huh? Mm, let me see, let me see. Biology. You have biology and you can say, in biology, you learn about um, our bodies, about uh, bacteria, and so on y muchos más, ok, like this, a very short description, so, help me please, a description for math, a description for math, who can tell me a short description for math? ¿Puedo hacer sobre religión, profesor? Ok, ok, let's start with reli eh, sería... religious education, ok. In religious education, look okay. in the Bible. You look, you look in the Bible. In the Bible, okay, that's perfect. And if in religious, you learn about one person. Aprendemos sobre one, one, one person, okay, one person, one, one thing. Who is this person? About Jesus' life. Jesus' life, okay, that's perfect. And also about. Jesus' life, okay? This could be a description for religious education. That's perfect. Very good, Valerie. Okay, number two. We have religious education. Okay, let's choose one. We have math, we have French, and we have social studies. Social studies are history, geography, English, literature, okay? So, let's choose one. Volunteer. Vale, Luis, Rosa, Lady, Danyomi, eh, Luis Ángel, Luis Alonso, Kiara, Jair, Alexander, Jairo, Nicole, Jean Paul, Mark, Wendy, Pamela, como Carolina, Antone, Valerie, Abril. ¿No? 
Okay, I'm going to choose. I, I'm going to choose and you are going to help me. Let's see. Mm, let's describe math. Okay, we have religious education. Now let's describe math. What do you do in math? Okay, help me please. What do you do in math? In maths, we realize exercise of numbers. We do uh, numbers, okay, numbers, exercises. Okay, that's perfect, that's perfect, very good. Let me see the chat. In the chat, I have more answers. Rosa said, in math, you look numbers, okay? Ah, okay, for example, Bruno have an answer for social studies. Huh? Let's try now social studies. Okay, let me see. Now, social studies, okay? Okay, help me please about social studies. For example, your partner, Bruno, told me in social study, we speak uh, about the rules of the society. Could be an answer, that's perfect. Help me please in social studies. What do you do in social studies? In history, geography, what do you do there? Andy, Chiara, Luis Alonso, Valerie, Valeria. What do you do in social studies? Or in history, okay? Easier. What do you do in history? Learn about the past. Okay, we learn. Okay, that's perfect. About the past, right? And in history, about the earth could be. Okay, let me. Let me check the chat. We have, ¿cómo se diría? Sobre, about. Sobre in English is about. That's perfect. So we have a description about uh, religious education, about math, about social studies. Now, let's see. A description about French, okay? Just imagine that you describe English, okay? Just imagine that you describe English. What do you do in French? Okay, let me check the chat. Here I have. In Carolina, tell me, in French, we learn the pronunciation. That's good. That's perfect. We learn the pronunciation. That's perfect. We learn the pronunciation. We learn also the grammar. That's important. Okay, that's perfect. So, ladies and boys, in activity number four, just you have described, okay? You have described these uh, school subjects. And in activity number three, you have complete with the school subject. Now, easy or complicated? Or oh, so-so? Easy, right? It's easy. That's perfect. Now, boys and girls, I need two volunteers, please. Two volunteers, students, I need one girl and one boy. Okay, I have Bruno, that's perfect, we have the boy. And now I need a girl volunteer, please. A girl volunteer to help me. Come on, girl's power, volunteer to help me. <gasps> Nobody really, or oh, the Docracia. Yo, I choose the Bruno, 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 Bruno Chica. Huh? Bruno, okay. Bruno and you. Pero Bruno okay. Chica. Luis, Luis. Okay. Okay. Bruno Chica, ya Bruno ya Chica. Luis Ángel y Bruno. Okay. Situación. Okay. Luis Ángel and Bruno. We don't have girls, so we have two boys. Huh? Let me see. Now, here, it's not in the platform. Okay, this page is not in the platform because it's only listen, uh, reading uh, comprehension, so it's, it's not in the platform. Okay, it's here. No está en la plataforma, solo está aquí because it's reading comprehension, okay? Okay, Kiara, Kiara, yes, but later, okay? Here we have two volunteers now, Luis Ángel and Bruno. Listen, eh, Luis Ángel, you Luis are... Antonio. Luis Antonio. <laughs> okay, you are no, Ana, Luis Ángel and Bruno, you are Ana, okay? No, but Bruno, oh, rayos. Okay, let's make it fun, let's make it fun. <laughs> You are, Anna, you are Anna, so you, you need to speak just as a girl, okay? Try to speak just as a girl. 
Ano si? Ano si Pang? 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 Like Kagera, okay? So, what are you doing tomorrow, Antonio? I'm like for okay? So, you know. Okay, so, please. Luis Angel, you are, uh, you are Antonio, and Bruno, you are Anna, okay? And the rest, please, let's pay attention because we are going to answer sentences, okay? We are going to decide if these sentences are correct or incorrect. So, then, I, I, uh, okay, then Kiara, Kiara Campos and Valerie are going to help me, okay? Valeria Benitez and Kiara Campo are going to help me. Kiara, you are going to be Antonio and Valeria Benitez, you are going to be Anna, okay? And Kiara Campos, you need to speak like a, like a boy, okay? <coughs> yeah, baby, like this, okay? So, Luis Angel Bruno, half of the conversation, la mitad nomás, and the other half, Kiara Campos and Valeria Benitez, okay? So, let's start. Please, pay attention to your partners, please. One, two, and three. Start, please. So, what are you going to, Antonio? I'm watching the match of Matchel Place. No, not tonight. I, I mean my future for a study. I'm not sure. First, I'm going to do my A-levels. Yeah, what subject are you studying? French, history, maths, and English. So, wait, are you doing the summer film course? I lack now. Do you want to head in field, into film? Okay, Luis. I don't know. I don't know yet, but I'm not going to be a businessman like my dad. I want to do something creative. Are you going to say <laughs> Liverpool by the seagull? Okay, Luis, no. No, I intend to move away from home. I plead to a scene college in London. Liverpool's great, but I think life in London is more exciting, more stimulating. What about you? Okay, thank you, Bruno, and thank you, Luis. That's perfect now. Your partners, okay? You and other partners. Kiara Campos and Valeria Benitez, okay? Valeria Benitez and Kiara Campos. You are here, okay? Here, Anna, I'm going to one, two, and three. Start, please. I am going to study acting at the LAC. I hope my dream is to be an actress. Yeah, well, you are certainly pretty, and you are talented. Do you think so? Yes, I do. By the way, uh, are you doing anything tonight? Um, no, nothing really. I am just going to wash my hair and chill out. Probably, why? Well. We don't, why don't we go out? But you're going to watch the mat with Mitchell. Oh, it's no big deal, really. There's this great band on a club ham. Very good, Chiara, and very good pronunciation, Valeria. That's Perfect, okay, and very good, Luis, and very good, Bruno, as well. Very, very good. So, only here, uh, uh, apply. What is the meaning of apply? Apply means enter, okay? Try to enter to, uh, to a school, to a university. For example, you say, I prepare in an academy to apply, to apply for the university, postular, try to enter, okay? That is the meaning of apply. Uh, 
it's not a big deal means, okay, oh, come on, it's not a problem, okay? That is the meaning of it's not a big deal, it's, it's not a problem. And here we have chill out. What is the meaning of chill out means relax, take a breath, okay? Relax. So, very good boys, very good girls. You have made a wonderful uh, job. I like your pronunciation. So we have read here a conversation about Antonio and about Anna's plans for the present or Antonio and Anna plans for the future. These plans, this conversation is from the present or from the future? Future. In the future. future. Very good for the future. And let's see, very good, Nicole. And they use that the present continues or they use another grammar? Let me see. They use, uh, you are washing, you are uh, cleaning, you are traveling, or they use another grammar? Another let's grammar. See, uh, another another gram grammar. Okay, let's see if you identify the grammar, okay? Listen, please, Anna. So, what are you going to do, Antonio? I'm washing the mask at Michelle's place. Oh, no, tonight. I mean, in the future work study. I'm not sure. First, I'm going to do my A levels. So they use the present continuous. They use another grammar, right? And what is this grammar? Who can identify? Who can identificarlo? It's also in the title. It's also in the title. También está en el title. Present continue. Is, okay, the present continue. Looks like the present continue, but boys and girls, girls and boys, today we are going to learn going to. Okay? Today we are going to learn going to. Okay? We, teacher, what is that going to? The going to, we use going to to talk about plans in the future, okay? But these plans in the future are longer, longer, okay? For example, remember, the present continuous in the future is a very short future. Uh, two hours, uh, two hours, five hours, one day after, okay? It's very, very short future, but then going to is for long, okay? One year, two year, five years, ten years, okay, is unlimited future, okay? This is our grammar today, okay? But before we go to the grammar, let's complete, okay, let's complete these sentences in number two, okay? We need to decide if these sentences in number two are true or these sentences are false, okay? So, let's see. Mm, let me see, let me see, let me see. Valeria Benitez, please. Can you read number one, please? Eduardo Silva, you read number two. Luis Alonso, you read number three. And Kiara Meoño, you read number four, okay? Valeria, Eduardo Silva, Luis Alonso, and Kiara Meoño. One, two, and three. Valeria, help me, please, number one. Um, Antonio. Wants to watch football tonight. Okay, that's perfect, Valeria. And for everybody, true or false? Antonio wants to watch football tonight. A match tonight, true or false? According to the reading. Look, the answer is in the second line. True oh, or false? Let me see. Who can tell me? Who me dice? It's false, porque oh. él, es, él, él practica natación, no practica fútbol. Ok, that could be the answer, that could be the answer, but let's analyze, please. Huh? Look, I'm watching the match at Michelle's place. Teacher, what is the match? The match means... Yeah. Uh, a, a soccer, a soccer, a soccer play or a basketball play, okay? So, Antonio wants to watch football tonight, true or false? Yes, true. 
true, okay? According to that paragraph, is true, okay? So, let's see. Let me see, let me see. True, Jairo, thank you. Okay, next, please, number two. Who was number two? King era number two. Eduardo Silva, please, number two. Help me, please. Eduardo, are you there? Is that allí? Antonio is staying in tonight. Okay, thank you. Is staying in tonight. It means Antonio is going to be in his house. True or false? Let me see. True. true. Answer, okay, verdad. the answer is here. Uh, the answer is here. Look. It's in the last line. Analyze, analyze this part. True or false? Antonio is going to stay tonight. It means he's going to be in his house. True or false? Analyze mm -hmm. this sentence, please. True. Mm. Let, let's see, huh? Look. False. And, and false, okay? Because Anna say, eh, no. Nothing really. I'm just going to watch my hair and chill out, probably. Why? And Antonio say, hey, well, why don't we go out? Go out means, hey, ¿por qué no salimos? Okay? And Anna say, but you are going to watch soccer. You are going to watch the match. Uh, no, no, it's not a problem. It's not a big deal. deal. Really? There is a great van on Clampat, okay? So, Antonio is going to stay in his house, true or false? False. False, thank you, Valerie. False, okay, that's false. Now, um, Chiara Meonio, please, help me in number three, Chiara. Help me in number three. Chiara Meonio. Hey. Thank you, estoy profe. Okay, thank you. Number three, please. Antonio wants to start a job, a job after school. Very good, a job after school, that's perfect. Let's see, let's see. The answer, the answer is here, okay? The answer is here, here, in this paragraph. Look at this paragraph, please. Remember, apply means postular. Huh? So, look at Antonio's answer and Antonio's answer. Are you going to stay in Liverpool? No, I intend to move away, travel away from home. Apply to a design, design college in London. Liverpool's great, but I think La, li, life in London is more excited. So, Antonio is going to apply for a job or apply for a college? Applying for a college. A college. So, Antonio wants to start a job, true or false? False. False. That's perfect. Is false. Okay, he wants to apply for a a school, a college. That's perfect. Let's see. Luis, please, Luis Angel, help me in number four, please. Uh, Antonio doesn't like Liverpool. That's perfect. Let's see. Uh, the answer is in the same paragraph. Antonio doesn't like Liverpool. Look, Liverpool's great, but I, but I think life in London is more exciting. So, true or false? False. False. Very good. Okay. Liverpool is great. It's fine. That's perfect. But he likes more uh, London. Okay. So those are the answers. Very good, Jair. Now, let's complete about Anna. Okay. That's very easy. Huh? Anna is very easy. Let's see. Nicole Molina, please activate your microphone and help me in number five. Nicole. Anna wants to be a doctor. 
Very good, Nicole. Anna wants to be a doctor. True or false? According to the reading. Mm. Let's see. True or false? The answer is here. Uh, the answer is here. Look. False. 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 Very good. Anna wants to be a doctor or what profession? What profession? According to this. Anna wants to be a um, actress. Actress. Very good. My dream is to be an actress. Okay. Very good. It's false. Now, boys and girls, Anna is staying tonight. Look, Anna is going to stay in her house. True or false? Look. Here we false. have a date, huh? False. Very good. Acá ya tienen una cita because they say, hey, it's not a big deal. There is a great van, okay? Now, let's see. Anna doesn't want to go out with Antonio. Doesn't want. True or false? Who can tell me? False. false, right? Yes, it's false because Antonio say, hey, let's go. And Anna could, could answer, okay? So number one is true and number two, three, four, five, six, and seven are 